Today I'm going to walk you through some simple steps you can take to get a comfortable shave, even if you have sensitive areas or easily irritated skin. To defend your skin from shaving irritation, the right preparation is critical. The first step is to wash your face and beard thoroughly. After rinsing your face, you may want to further hydrate by soaking a towel with warm water and holding it against your skin for two to three minutes. This will do two things. One, remove oil, dirt, and dead skin that can block your razor's path and prevent a smooth glide. And two, soften your hair, making each strand easier to cut through. Now all you need are the proper shaving tools to get started with your shave. Use a good shave gel to help the razor glide smoothly over the contours of your face and neck. Once you've applied the right shave gel for your sensitive skin, the next tool you need is a multi-blade razor. Check to make sure that the blades are close together. The closer the blades, the less opportunity for skin to get caught between the blades. If you feel the blades of your razor tugging, it may be time to switch it out for another. Or, if you have an indicator strip on the back of your razor, check to see if it's faded to white. A white strip means that your blade has dulled, indicating that you may want to switch to a fresh blade. To shave, use light, gentle strokes. Many guys feel that first shaving with the grain of your hair, that is, in the direction that your hair is growing, and then following up with strokes in the opposite direction provides the closest, smoothest shave. However, since facial hair tends to grow in different directions, you'll almost always be shaving both with and against the grain. An advanced razor like this one will deliver a close shave even against the grain. You should shave in the direction you're most comfortable with. The neck tends to be the most sensitive area on your face, but if you shave it last, the shave gel will have more time to soften the hair, allowing your blade to cut even easier. If your razor has a single blade trimmer, use it to carefully shave under your nose. This will give you easier access to hard to reach hair without running the risk of over shaving your sensitive upper lip. You may notice that your razor occasionally gets clogged, so you should rinse out your blades with running water every few strokes. Rinse your face with cold water to soothe the skin. Finally, try applying a hydrating aftershave lotion to moisturize your face and neck. A good aftershave with moisturizing ingredients like this one will rehydrate, calm, and comfort the skin. Okay, let's recap. Prepare your skin. Use the right tools for your skin type. And moisturize your skin. Thanks for watching. And be sure to check out our other videos for more tips and information.